that's four. All right, and welcome back to the channel, buddy, and I hope you're doing fine. So today I want to talk about my, at least currently, favorite slug shotgun. So what are slugs? Slugs basically turns your shotgun into a rifle that can one tap at closer distances. Now, buckshot, of course, is a little bit more forgiving because you point in the general direction and then you hope, yep, pellet spread, be my friend. Um, but very often you get hit markers and if you're not really looking frame by frame, you don't understand why is this guy not dying? I mean, I shot him clearly in the chest and then you realize in slow-mo you didn't. So you get a little bit of a weird feedback from buckshot or penny shot. How much damage did you really deal? I'm not the only one probably who like spectated in quick play or afterwards in bounty hunt when I get killed by a shotgun or by a rifle or whatever. And I'm like, this guy almost lost no health to my shotgun shell. So you get rid of this RNG by using slug ammo. Now, I would say the most cost efficient slug shotgun is the rival because you have the fast two tap. It has a little bit less range though than the other shotguns because it's not a full size barrel. I know that there is like way more shotgun slugs out there. For example, you can put it in Romero, especially after the price changes for 65 bucks. Playing one slug uh, type and one buckshot is totally valid. I know that a lot of people also like the slate. Some people like to play the terminus with iron repeater. For me personally, the Spectre was, show, was always a favorite. Be it with buckshot, be it with flechette, be it with slugs. I don't know why, but it's my personal favorite from all these shotguns. I'm weird, I guess. So today we're gonna play that together with a, um, what was it? Yeah, exactly. A Pax with bleed. Now, lots of people are always, but Mike, you always say, full custom ammo is bad. Mm, they're not bad, they're just a little bit harder to resupply sometimes. The packs comes with a lot of bleed ammo, and the idea behind is you tank people with the bleed ammo, they have to take cover, stop the bleeding, need to heal up. It takes a little bit longer, and then you can push them with the shotgun. Now, where should you use this loadout? Obviously in compounds, and this is also what I'm gonna show you today, with uh, some various tools and consumables that you can combine with a nice little shotgun. So don't miss your decoy fuses. That hive sucks, dude. Dude, how did that emulator not trigger on you? That's okay. He sh I mean, his primary probably can do it. Another mind, like Bleed ammo cannot pen, but... I would like to beetle, but I'm scared that one of them pushes me the moment I use the beetle, so... I just want to see what they have as primaries. Well, this is now slightly dumb what I'm doing. a new army with bleeds.
Yeah, was it only one? What was this loadout? Huh? I, I don't think he's alone. Why is there a bounty? Shit. Fuck. Indecisiveness! Yee! Fuck, dude. Okay, if I lose this one, this is totally on me, man. Ah, I'm missing the 25, dude. Tiny bit faster. Not by much, but it's enough. Ah, dude! Ugh. Okay. I maybe deserve this one, but they deserved it too. Oh, dude. I shoot him with the slugs in the face, but that small bound the right, bro. by bullet brother back shot for the wind dude this is lux another mind breaks and joins the psychotic host okay Now I don't know why, but the Spectre for me personally is just doing it without costing too much money. Because sure, if you just look at the stats, you take the crown and ping with uh, the crown and ping. Yeah, the crown and king, clown and cringe, clown and cringe. You take the clown and cringe with slugs and you just go with that one. But honestly, it's not cost efficient. You will die very often to a winny handshot and you're like, hmm, well, my loader was a little bit expensive and I died to this 50 bucks something gun. That's kind of lame. And with the Spectre, you don't really get that feeling. It's still cost efficient to get it with the rival. Or the Romero. You know? So, sure, if you like the Crown, go for it. I honestly only play the Crown and King when it's like lying around on the floor. Then I take it. It's also something about the fire rate. If I have a semi auto weapon, be it Dolls, Bornheim, be it a Crown and King, I kind of. I kind of rush my shots and I get very derpy and I'm like, oh, I have this high fire rate. I need to use this fire rate. And that is kind of dumb. Don't do that. And the Spectre has like this nice boom and then you pump and you can readjust your... Well, I don't really need to do it because they all died to uh, a single shell in that one. With some Gucci headshots there, actually. And we have one more and I mentioned the Degoy fuses. And they're nice for pushing and they're also nice for bamboozling people. And... uh 
yeah, sometimes people use very weird psychological warfare tricks. This one gets fire because that's a teammate of the new team. Okay, she's going up. Fair enough. Burn here. The problem is I cannot dauntless this now, the fuck? Why would you do that? Wait, what? And that's four. That's it. Good loadout. Good loadout. My upgrade, thank you. That's whatever. Let's check her. Okay. Oh, yeah, okay. I would like to burn the dudes inside just to uh, have a little bit less good gear on the floor that can bite me in the ass later. I'm gonna wait here for a second. Another it's lame, line. it's try hard, I don't care. Just luck as fuck, thank you for the gifted sub there. Also, Duke of Dim, thank you for the five gifted, I appreciate it. We have Backlog of the 21, Horror Movie Dick, Papa Kodiak, Blood Red J, thank you for the primes and the five from Biddies. And Smokey the Purton with the five gifted. Appreciate it. And everybody else that I see is uh, honestly, thank you very much, guys. I, I don't know which one I already did, but. Thank you. Uh, how do you change consumable slots mid-game? You hold the hotkey where you want it to be. Okay. 
Yeah, fuck that. That's way too far. Nah, no, let's try. Fuck it. I'm playing the Spectre with slugs. I think they're killing it right now. Ooh, fanning. Okay. I think it's shirt. The problem is that I cannot make it in time. So I cannot collect more clues. More clues would give me more dark side. It would make it safer to travel across the map. Have you improved on that? Uh, checking the death screen and kill views. That, that's it. Sadly. So I kind of have to not scan. But I'm gonna scan before crossing the bridge. But yeah, dude, this is this is church, and I think they're killing it right now. Let's see. I'm scanning now here. That is clear. And the question is, do I go Stillwater first? If I go Stillwater first, and I don't think it's there, I have more distance to cover, and of course, then less seconds to cover this. But if I go church immediately, another mind breaks and joins the psychotic. Race. I go church immediately. I have three minutes twenty seconds of stamina boost, so I should take advantage of that. We're gonna go to church from here, so I take this forest here. The forest covers me more or less, gives the uh, long another ammo boys over breaks, there, whatever that is, um, a harder time seeing me. And I will use the last two seconds to scan the compound. So if somebody's not sitting here in the forest, then tough luck, dude. GG, solo life says goodbye. Hey, good morning, right back to you, man. Okay. One team left downstairs. <sighs> mm, they're up. There are some slugs. It's nice. Oh, he fucking ducked. He had no idea I was there.
Oh, der war's fucking close. Hi Mike. What's up, dude? What's up, boy? Wanna share? <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. Cool. Awesome. Uh, <laughs> I think it's okay. It's my first time with you. Come here. I have no med kits. So I come with the. <laughs> it's been an honor. You did some killing already here. Yes, yes. Nice. We have three teams, four hey, teams. Dude. Oh, I okay. I killed two at livestock, so that's probably it. <laughs> okay, cool. Then have a nice day. You too. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Well. <laughs> Mike. Mike. Huh? Mike. Mike. Yeah. Yeah. Be yeah. Careful. There are. Uh, Traps? All over the area uh, trap combos. Ew. Who taught you that, man? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man. Be safe. You too. Thanks. Oh my god, where are they now? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna dodge all the high grass. Oh my god, this is so unfair, Mr. Streamer. Yeah, dude. I mean, come on. He was a nice guy. <laughs> nice. Oh, ah, yeah. I mean, <laughs> uh, I'm dumb. I'm like, whoa, no! <laughs> uh, They even get a second bounty now, dude. This is amazing. Single doggo. Where's your pack, Tom? Why did you betray the white monster? Because it's not cold enough and it's in the fridge right now. <laughs> Another mind breaks and joins the psychotic host. No, guys, stop with the stream sniping bullshit. If I kill somebody, my name is on the dev screen. And people who follow me kind of know my names. That's all. That is all, my dude. And I also picked up the bounty seal. <laughs> oh yeah, they know already for a long time that it's me. Oh, so he played the... Oh, he played that card. Oh, uh, I see. I see. Oh, and they play the cards the moment the first guy goes down. I see. Oh, no diplomacy before that, huh? Oh, I see how it is! Oh, no! Oh. Uh, okay. Uh. I see how it is! Alright, alright! Nah, no, it's cool. No, it's cool. It's cool. It's fucking cool. Nah. Understandable. <laughs> GG. Another That's a good match. Breaks and joins the psychotic host. 
<laughs> they probably got distracted while they were fighting, guys. You have offered to share not yet. Nice. Nine and eight. Another mind breaks and joins the psychotic host. Whew. Then I'm still missing a couple of trades. So yeah, that's it for today. Uh, diplomacy only when you're on the losing end. I see what you did there, but that's okay. I got my bounty. Next time I'm gonna take your life too. Okay, and then thank you to my patrons. As always, thank you for the support. You guys are amazing and you're super duper appreciated. Thank you for watching. Next up we have a, uh, hmm, feels almost like an aimbot game. And we're gonna drop a little bit in quick play. And I'm gonna show you some Warhammer. Nice. And see you in the next one. Until then. Have a good day and bye-bye.